Let's say Dominic still isn't ready by the end of the year or even early next year, which mm -hmm. you should completely wait for, for that mm -hmm. title shot. I yeah. wouldn't take anything else besides that title exactly. shot. If, but if he's out for a year, let's it's say interim. some other... Interim, yeah. that, well, I guess. I yeah. doubt they do that, but yeah. it'd be Cody Garbrandt. Yeah. I mean, uh, the only way I'm fighting is for the belt. You know, if it's for the belt, interim belt, whatever it is, like that's how I'm fighting. I mean... I, so I just fought number two ranked fighter Rafael Sincel on an eight fight win streak. God, I, was, I forgot he was number two. I was two. ranked number one. So number one beats number two. Where do you go from there? Do <sighs> I drop down? And it was that's, that's, that's and, what's and like, it was in a this fight. is what's so puzzling to me. I, I, I it's it, the, the exciting fight, the fight for certainly for an MMA purist or any fan is to watch you and Dominic Cruz, the most yeah. unorthodox fighters in the world. I mean, that's the fight. If, that's, you're, if you're a true MMA fan. I mean, right? But if you're if fighting you're, if you're, in a way, I've never seen anybody yeah. fight the way you do. It's, the whole thing is crazy. And the same thing with uh, Dominic Cruz. Yeah. It's a numbers thing, yeah. it'll be. It's, it's, it's all the new fans. Thing. All these new fans that don't know as much about MMA, don't know what a, a arm bar is, they don't know yeah. all the technique that I'm throwing out there. They're more into the story. They're more into the... the the WWE factor of the drama instead but there's of there's a story there because what other yeah. fight would be a bigger story? No, there's not. Cruz and yeah. you don't. And I, I love Cody, but Cody versus Dominic, there's no, there's no really story, yeah. right? I guess Alpha Male, but he really it, wasn't there when the beef was there. The only but he's story. also number eight. Yeah, yeah, exactly. How does number eight leapfrog number one when you just beat number two? Yeah, I'll tell you no what's sense. a fucking b -b barn burner, and you're welcome, Joe Silva. If you had Jimmy Rivera versus and Cody Garbrandt. Cody Garbrandt. That's, yeah. that's a tough fight. Fuck you. That would be a good fight. Fuck fight. you. Someone's getting knocked out. Yeah, because I think they both come. They both stand Straight in a phone booth. Yeah, they just they just come right at each it's other. It's a good Absolutely. fight. But yeah. it, it, I can't see them doing anything besides you versus Dom. I, and, I, and that's, that's what I keep saying. Yeah, <laughs> that's what I keep saying. That's what I keep hoping for. So I'm waiting for the phone call. I'm staying ready. I'm. All, I, I can only control what I can control. I can't. Con I gotta continue to have fun. I Correct. think I put too much pressure on the first cruise fight. I want to knock him out and get too emotional and hating his trash talk and getting affected by it. Where I just need to make sure to continue to have fun and control what I can control. And he if I can't, not to sweat over. I don't stress about it because life's only too long and this career's only so long and. I just got to enjoy it. Yeah, he strikes sure me, Dominic Cruz fight. strikes me as a very difficult personality. He, <laughs> he strikes me as a, he's got a a not a warm fight. He, he's a walking with cactus. With, he's with a, everything. He's I a mean, walking cactus. I, I worked with him on UFC tonight and, exactly. and on uh, on UFC now, and he yeah. is, he's mean, our, he's he is tough. Everyone, yeah. everyone with Fox is like, yeah, he's... He's tough. He's got a chip on his shoulder. He's a tough he, he personality. Like everyone kind of owes him a little bit. And then his trash talk is kind of crazy too because it usually doesn't mean anything. He won't even like t like make sense on what his trash talk is. He'll just talk louder and talk more than you and kind of piss you off. Yeah. And it's, listen, like, it's like high school girls listen, fighting in high school. He's a know? brilliant competitor though. Yeah. And he's a brilliant fighter. Yeah. And so, you know, as are you. And so, you know, whatever Dominic Cruz is, he's, yeah. he's fucking he's good, amazing. Man. And yeah. so are you. And that's why I want to see that fight. I mean, Appreciate it's just... It's it's just a fact. You, with with the smaller weight classes, like I like for DJ, for DJ, I think for him to become mainstream and to get, I mean, if he headlines a pay per view, he gets like seven. It literally he gets seven from his hometown. Like it's hard. He's he's just so tiny, but he's yeah. he's magnificent. He's a phenomenal fighter. Mm -hmm. For a guy like that, and I wish the UFC would do something with him. Grant, they're trying this Ultimate Fighter series where they have all these, you know, world champions from all over. If we don't know those guys, no one gives a fuck. Mm -hmm. Grant, the Ultimate Fighter might help with that. For him, he needs to take super fights, a super fight with TJ I want to fight Demetrius Johnson. I'm a, I'm a huge fan of the guy. Great dude. He's awesome. I think he's pound for pound the best in the fighter in the world. I want to get my belt back, and I want to fight Demetrius Johnson. There you go. You do. Want, you man. do. Heck yeah, man. I huh. want to be the best pound for pound in the fighter in the world. I mean, that's the, the whole point of me doing this is to be the best, you know, and to do so, I need my belt back first. That's first God, and foremost. I, I don't get why he doesn't do it. No, so let's say, let's say you fight Dominic. He's yeah. going to fight the winner of the ultimate fighter. Yeah. But the cool thing is that's the super fight. I can actually drop to 125. I know. I, I, I don't worry about cutting weight till five days before the fight. I'm only 150 pounds through fight camp. I can make 125. You can make 125. I want my belt back. <laughs> and then I'll be, I'll fight Demetrius. So Johnson. you want both? You, you can want, do it though. though yeah. he, he can go to thirty-five. Oh, yeah. He can go to thirty-five. He's yeah. fought at thirty-five. Yeah. He can go to twenty-five. You can yeah. both. It, it makes sense. Yeah. Would you rather fight him at thirty-five or twenty-five, or do you not care? I'd rather fight him at twenty-five, so you can get that belt. Yeah, well, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> That's the plan, though. Fuck man. two belts. Yeah, it's my plan at least. You know, but obviously, first first goal, get my belt back. You know, push for that cruise fight. There's things I got to change up in that fight. You know, I gotta. Be a little more composed. Play his game. You know, I got to play yeah. his, his point fighting game. He's not going to come out there and try to knock you out and be this aggressive fighter. He's going to point fight you. And mm -hmm. I, I knew that going into it, but I and he's got a chin, man, because I cracked him. Then if a you're watching that, yeah. a, a good head kick that I broke my foot on, and there's a, a punch in the fourth or fifth round where I whipped his chin behind him, and mm -hmm. 
He he took it. He's know? he's not a guy you can go into going. I'm I'm going to finish this guy. He, and I was too. His, his fight IQ is yeah. way way yeah. too high. You tell me. He's just brilliant. He's, he's really got good timing. Man. You know. I yeah. mean, I wouldn't say he's like super technically sound for a normal like kickboxer or a wrestler. He doesn't have like normal technique, but for his style of fighting, he's got good technique. He's, he's elusive as a mother. Super fucker. elusive and it's good it, timing. His fight IQ is is, is yeah. so so high. So anyone who goes in going, I, I'm gonna I'm gonna get after this guy. I'm gonna try and get him out of there. You've yeah. lost the yeah. fight. Yeah. yeah. So and much. Granted, you had that game plan, and we still gave you three. Rounds. I well, I won. I, I thought. Yeah, I thought I had four, but I'm pushing it there. <laughs> yeah. You're like, ah, I had a five zero, man. Yeah. <laughs> Just biased as shit. Yeah. My wife is like, I had it five zero too. 